world's, world's, world's famous. <sighs> Hello, um, long time no video. Okay, so this is the first part of my birthday makeup haul. I have two. One is collective and one... And another one is Max. So let's start with the CCO stuff. I got four things. Ow. Okay, I got four things. This is a cream stick liner in ginger root, I believe. Ginger root. This is really good for you girls who like like nude lipsticks. Um, this looks really good with Angel and even Creme de Nude. Um, I usually use stripped down, but it, it was just a little too brown for me. So this has a little bit more pink undertone, so I like that a lot. Um, and then I, since I'm a lash fiend, I bought more lashes. I like this one a lot. They're very similar to my 43s, but just a little bit more sparse. So if you look at these, these are my 43s. They're a lot fuller, and these are like the sparse version. And there's no number to these. I think these came out together with a collection. And it's called Blinking Cool. You can't even read that. I'm not going to do that. But I like these a lot. They're very natural looking. I wore them already. Um, for you girls who like wearing lashes every day, I think that's one that you can wear a lot. And that was only eight fifth day. What? Yeah. MAC lashes are like $12 now. They used to be 10 and then they went to 11 and then now they're fucking $12. Like, what the fuck, MAC? Really? I could buy like five pairs of Ardell's for then. I got me another paint pot. I want paint pots that have more color in them, but a lot of those are limited edition. So I'm like currently on the hunt for those. Um, but since I'm doing a lot of neutral, folly type looks lately with my makeup, I figured quite natural would only be perfect. So you guys already know what that looks like. It's like a brown, chocolate brown. This is actually good for smoky looks too. Um, I tried it with like a smoky black brown look and it actually looked really really nice so this is a little versatile and it was only I think 13 12 something it doesn't say but I think it was like 12 oh there sorry 1175 that's not bad for a paint pot because these are like 1650 so building my paint pot collection slowly and then and then and then and then finally I got another Hello Kitty product the CCO I went to in Vacaville didn't have a lot of Hello Kitty shit, but they did have this. And I've been wanting this for hella long because I like the compact. So I bought it for the compact, unfortunately. Um, it was $15.50. And I got Tahitian Sand. This color doesn't really turn out on me very much. That's what it, was. it can work as a blush, I think, but on me it doesn't really work. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but... I paid fifteen dollars for this, so whatever. At the Mac store, um, holiday came out, as you guys know. I have too many lip glosses. You want to see my lip gloss drawer? It looks terrible. Look at that. That's lip glosses, and this isn't. Ooh, this isn't even all of it. There's more in my train case. Trust me. These are just ones that I like tend to pick a lot. Yeah, right. All of that I pick from that. So, I, I wasn't really into the lip gloss test, but they are pretty. I think they're all pretty. They're all worth having. And the pigment collections were probably the most sought out after, sought after, the most sought out, you know what I, you know what I mean. Everybody wanted them. So I got Cool Capers. Has all of these. Um, I already had Deep Blue Green in a sample, but now I have it in a vial. Um... I really, really like pigments because there's so much that you can do with them. And me doing the kind of makeup that I do on people, um, sometimes it's for stage and you need that intense makeup. And pigments are really good for that. So in this one came, okay, this one's deep blue green. This is permanent, by the way. Uh, this one is grape. I think this one's pro. I'm not sure. Pro or, or limit. I know it's a limited edition Ray Promote. And then there's fuchsia, which is permanent. And then Kitchmas, Kitchmas, whatever. Um, this is a, also a re-promote um, and limited. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if it's pro. And then Reflex Teal, the glitter Reflex Teal. This is amazing. I used it this weekend on top of an eyeshadow, and it was like 
fucking gorgeous. It doesn't look like that when you, you know, put it on, but it has, like, different color specs. Really good for the holidays, in my opinion, like, for holiday looks and, again, for stage makeup. The only reason why I like glitter is for stage makeup and to just bring a little, like, to your eyes sometimes on your looks. For those of you who don't, who have never had a chance to buy pigments or don't want to buy a full jar, these sets are really good for you because they're only, like, 32-something, 32.50. And if you buy all three, that's like honestly buying like probably four or five pigments, full jars, and you get like 15 vials of 15 different ones. So that's a good deal. Then, as you all know, I love my cheeky bronze. I love, 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 love my cheeky bronze. This is my favorite MSF ever. It hasn't hit the dome yet like it hasn't flattened the dome because I was scared that I'd never find one so I use it very sparingly you actually don't need a lot but this is like my favorite 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 MSF next to Sol Ceylon I love this one a lot a lot a lot and I had porcelain pink which didn't exactly give me the same look that I was looking for with it so being that it was sold out and I could only find it online Guess what my MUA found for me? Because she knows how much I love it. So she got me a backup of my cheeky bronze. And now I can use the other one however much I want because I have a backup. Another thing she did for me was she actually found a limited edition blush, mineralized blush, that is very, very similar to cheeky bronze. And it's called Improvise. You guys know from watching my blushes video, or if you know if you watched my blushes video, that I like really like peachy looking shades so they're very similar this is um this one's improvised and that one's cheeky bronze they're very similar just improvises a little bit lighter because of the gold but now i have another dupe for this and this actually looks really pretty on top of um that mineralized blush that just came out on holiday also super duper natural i think it's what it's called when you put these together it looks really really pretty and i've been on a lipstick hype like for real like I seriously um, I'm in a pink lipstick phase <laughs> and I'm currently trying to collect all the ones that I never got to get or ones that I've missed so I bought four sad I know first one I got was up the amp I, okay I need to stop doing that because it's not doing shit <laughs> I bought up the amp which I'm wearing right now looks like that so pretty so pretty it reminds me of um for fun the nail polish love this color love and you can wear different lip glosses on top to either bring out the purple or bring out the pink bring out the blue like whatever like shazam actually looks hot on top of this oh yeah okay and then uh, this one that's permanent by the way it's an amplified and then I got a frost lipstick in Angel. You guys should all know this one. This is one of the pinky nudes that should be in your collection. Right there. So pretty. So, so pretty. Again, a good one with Shazam. I gotta get Shazam. I'm lagging on that. And then I got the two that came out with Color Ready, which was days ago. And I never got to get these, and I always, always, always wanted them. The first one is Impassioned. I, okay, stop doing that. This is so pretty, so pretty. If you girls like flower shades, like flower colored shades, oh, oh, yeah. Sexy. And then, because I've been looking all over for the shit, Seriously, I've been looking all over for this shit. And I didn't want to have to go through the trouble of ordering through Pro. I wanted it like right then and there. For those of you girls who are makeup heads, this is the shit. Like the shit. Okay. This is Show Orchid. To some of you, this might look like a basic pink lipstick. And it's not. So if that's what you think it is, honey, you're so wrong. This color is amazing. Like, Girl About Town was my shit for hella long. 
and um, there was another one that I really liked but this oh, it's like girl about town with like some blue undertones to it it's so pretty I'm so happy I found it now I'm on the hunt for Saint Germain and lavender whip so if any of you girls know where I can find that holla at me so that's it for all the Mac see that was one video worth wasn't it um stay tuned for my collective haul